morning, state investigators are piecing together what started a deadly shootout in Hartford after a police officer shot and killed a suspect. Channel 3 Eyewitnesses reporter Luke Hydash is on this story. He's live at the Hartford Police Department this morning with the chilling images. And Luke, for some, this image is just hard to see. Yeah, definitely hard to see for some people. Hartford's mayor here, Luke Bronin, says that suspect opened fire on the officer after police stopped him. Police were looking for that car that he was in after they got quite a few 911 calls from people saying that there was a man in the city going around in a car with a gun inside threatening people. That is definitely why they were after that person that night, that afternoon, I should say. It happened around 2 o'clock on Barber Street. We know cameras were in that area. You're seeing some of those surveillance images now. And the officer involved, good news, he is uninjured this morning. Both he and the suspect have not yet been identified. Family members of the man killed, they are grieving this morning. When it's your family on the other end of something just so graphic, like having to log in, to social media and see your family member laying on the ground. Their last moments on this earth is just traumatizing. As we wait to learn the name of that Hartford police officer, he is on administrative leave this morning. That is protocol as the state inspector general investigates this. We're live in Hartford this morning. Luke Hydash, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.